Alright guys, I tried to make this video a couple times. It's July. It's the official shoutout month. It's here. Let me get some shoutouts in. Alright, shout out to Ashley, Steve, Jeremy, Jeremy, TJ, Courtney, Big Bert, Carlos, Errol, Zach, Matt, Oscar. And they wanted me to say what's Gucci. And I have to apologize to the girl I made the video about. Her name is not Elaine. It's Eileen. Sorry for the mispronunciation. Alright, bitches. I was going to talk about the main subject in this video. George, blah, blah, blah. George Zimmerman. This fucking asshole who killed Trayvon Martin roughly like five months ago or so. Anyway, what really got me... I have stayed silent about this case for a long time. It's back in the news. He's still on trial. What is pissing me off is that his dad said, okay, the, the 911 call where someone screams for help and then a shot is fired, his dad says, oh, uh, that's positively George on the phone, that George screaming for help. That's bullshit. When you have a gun on somebody like this, you are not screaming for help. Because, I mean, you may feel like you're in danger, but you're not screaming for help. Your help is right in your fucking hand, and it's a gun. And then he shot it. You don't yell help and be like, help! Bam! And kill somebody. That doesn't work like that. The pitch of the, the, pitch of the voice, it was 110 fucking percent Trayvon. And apparently, um, Zimmerman saw Trayvon with a hoodie on, as you all may know, walking the gated community. He thought he was suspicious. He went and uh, probably said or remarked something that Trayvon didn't like. He probably uh, said something to him that pissed Trayvon off. Trayvon might have attacked him. He said Trayvon started it. I don't believe... I think George Zimmerman started the conflict, but Trayvon mar might have started uh, the physical part of it. But anyway, Trayvon was unarmed. Yeah, he maybe smashed that piece of shit George Zimmerman's head into the cement, but that fucker deserved it. That paranoid piece of shit who tried to become a cop because he wants to boss everyone around. And, you know, wants to, what the fuck is his problem? I mean, just because someone's wearing a hoodie doesn't mean they're a fucking criminal. And maybe the media painted the picture that um, George Zimmerman was this ex-convict piece of shit and Trayvon was this happy-go-lucky honorable student. You know, maybe that wasn't 100% true and Trayvon had gotten into drugs, but that does not make his life any, you know, less than anyone else's, all right? Trayvon should be here right now living his life. But, but because of George Zimmerman being a fucking cunt and trying to be John Wayne, he capped him. That's bullshit. And his cocksucker dad saying that it was George on the phone. That is 100% bullshit. It does not add up. It makes no sense. George Zimmerman needs to be convicted. If I was in a lawyer, I would, have, I would have George Zimmerman already locked up right now. It would be a sex man conviction. This motherfucker's done. Give him to Jesse Jackson. Uh, Al Sharpton. They're going to have a 4th of July barbecue. And they're going to shove a whole lot of fireworks up George Zimmerman's ass. And he's going to fly sky high and fucking burn up. Alright? Fuck George Zimmerman. He's guilty. 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 Done. Alright? Trayvon. Deserves better. Trayvon deserves justice. George Zimmerman and his fucking lawyers playing little games. I mean, you do not fucking pull out a gun. Okay, I don't care. If someone is physically attacking you, like fucking punching you in the face, yes, you attack them back, but not with something that could kill them. Not with a pistol. You attack them back with your hands or a pepper spray or taser. Something not as fucking lethal as a goddamn gun. Alright? And George Zimmerman brought the gun. He brought that into equation. He, somewhere in the back of his head, he thought he might have to sh shoot Trayvon. He fucking did. That's why he brought the gun. I mean, maybe he thought Trayvon had a weapon, but Trayvon didn't. And Trayvon never sh pulled out a weapon. So what was the point of shooting him? You know, the, fuck all this probable cause bullshit. I don't fucking care. Zimmerman's guilty. Trayvon deserves justice. You heard it here. I mean, if this guy gets off on bail and doesn't even, it doesn't get convicted, the, the American justice system is fucked, alright? And Al Sharpton, Jesse Jackson, and all the Black Panthers are gonna rape that motherfucker and kill him. And I mean, I think it's justified, you know? Someone who... 
<sighs> it just pisses me off, guys. Fuck George Zimmerman. He should be in jail. You people got your shoutouts. I got a fuckload more to do. You know, I'll do as many as I can. But I mean, August 1st comes around. Uh-uh. No more shoutouts, guys. But for July, I'm doing it. Stay tuned, motherfuckers. I'm going to try to see Ted, Spider-Man, The Dark Knight Rises. All right, I'll, I'll give you some movie reviews. I haven't done them in a while. All right, bye, bitches. Oh,